Plastic Model Builders. Hello, it's me, Ari Stone. This is the Tamiya F4B Phantom 2. Just did a box break of that, showed you what's inside. These are the instructions. I briefly showed you the booklet in the review of this. If you want to see the instructions in full, here they are. Watch all of it, subscribe, comment, and like if you haven't done that yet. That way you can get our videos when they come out. Sometimes I surprise you and I put one out before it's two weeks time. So here are the instructions in full detail. All right, so let's get started. This is the McDonnell Douglas F4B Phantom 2 by Ravel. You can see you got the picture right there. Here is all the paint colors. There's a lot of them, tools you need. There's the three models you could do. Let's start with picture one here. Starting with painting the interior of where the cockpit is supposed to go. Step two, I'm gonna put some miscellaneous parts on the outside of the first part of the fuselage. Part three, we're gonna do the same thing for the other parts of the fuselage and put some decals on if you want. Part four, we're going to start putting together the flight deck, the cockpit, all that good stuff. You see that stuff going in there. These are the control panels for step five that need to be painted. A bunch of those, get them right. So a little bit more of the control panel, all that stuff for step seven, same thing. Step eight, put more panels on there for the cockpit seat. Good stuff, I know you love it. Step nine, we're going to build the wheel well for the front wheel there are the walls for it. step 10 putting the parts in so the wheel can rest in step 11 we're going to put those walls in step 12 put the cockpit in along with the instrument panels so you can see there for step 13 we've got our nozzles for our exhausts and our engines step 14 here are the engines we're going to put those onto the nozzles step Step 15, we're putting the nozzles in and the cockpit, plus that piece that goes across the top to hide the seam. Step 16, use your pin vise to drill all these little holes for the pylons, important stuff, and for the wheels. Good stuff. Here is that wheel section that goes inside of the plane, on the wheels, on the wings. Here it is getting installed, along with some other miscellaneous activities. Turn the page over because you can see that where that the engines go right there. Step 19, we're going to put this on fuselage onto the bottom of the wings, put our ailerons, flareons, whatever. So this goes on the bottom in step 20. That's the bottom of the plane right there where the wheel well will go. Step 21, we've got our side parts of the intakes. Put those on step 22. This is the left side. Put that in build your engines get those together I know it's fun stuff step 23 slide these into the plane carefully it tells you to kind of go back and put them in easy process step 24 this is the tail stabilizers goes in there so you got those little things there step 25 this is where it's going to fit into you can see that right there nice and easy be careful put on the tail hook other miscellaneous activities step 27 build the nozzles right here the uh, basically that's for the rear of the plane step 28 we've got our gear doors so we got to put those in step 29 here it is with the gear doors getting put in and some other stuff I know you love this it's model making madness so make it look pretty please I love how you do this. There we go, so that's step 29. Step 30, put on the front wheel door. Yes, that's if you're doing gears down. Step 31, we're putting the gear in, front gear, you see the actuators there. Step 32, got the other door there that folds down over it and some decals. Step 33, got the front of the nose and the thing that goes on the front of the nose. Step 34, rear wheels and the rear doors for the wheels those all kind of go together put them together then you can put those onto the plane you got the left one and the right one this is an exhaust port goes down inside of the plane you see it put together there and then where it fits in right there you put the wheels on the plane left and right so now this is where it gets fun for the wings tips up the flareons down the flap-ons on flapperons and then the air brakes so these are the ways you can build them for step 37. Open and closed, of course. And then this is all the stuff involved with it. Here you are putting on the 
wing tips either open or closed. And that step, step 40, putting in the flaperons either up or down, depending on which one you want. Step 41, the air brakes up or down, same thing. And you see that here is the illustration for both of those. Bunch of pylons, bunch of them, paint them, put them together, put some decals on, put the stuffs on the side of them, the rails. Here they are. I'm going to put those onto the plane, a little miscellaneous stuff for that step 44. And then step 45 is the aim sparrows, paint them, put the fins on, decal them, sidewinders, same thing, put the tip on, just the tip. Uh, here you go, putting those onto the plane and the sparrows right there they go easy drop tank put that on for step 47 and 48 there it is going on to the aircraft very easy fun stuff right here more missile rails drop tank rails whatever you want to call them the rails that go on the plane so step 50 here is the drop tank it's the outer wing drop tank You're going to put that on got some other stuff here it is going on to the aircraft with the rails the supports and then the tail put the tail together with the antennas that separate piece there for step 53 right here you're putting that little thing at the end put the tail onto the plane this is the ejection seat put that together make it look pretty put your man together put the decals on the helmet glue them down step 56 you're going to put those into the plane after the fact rare that happens but hey this is how they do it in this model um, here's some of the aft station instrument panel. You're going to get that together and put that in. Obviously, they made this easy. Step 58, this goes on to the front of the plane, and then you will also put the cockpit stuff on. And these are the options right here for the cockpit canopies up or down. This is how you do it. Step 60, right there. If you're doing it all sorts of fun ways, make it look pretty. You got those rails to put in there for the up versions. 61 is the down version just slap some stuff on there and you're pretty much good to go step 62 you got your fuel tube and here you have it well that's it thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe comment and like and until next time see ya